with senior coach Ross Lyon. Ross, we just wrapped up the intra-club match. How did you find it? Yeah, it was our first hit out, um, 90 minutes. So a couple of boys cramping at the end. Um, and we'd, we'd had a heavier load during the week. So that was pleasing uh, our competitive spirit. And we set the teams up to be even rather than a probables and a possibles. Um, so therefore it was really tight. I think there was a kick in it at the end. Um, and a few of our young players looked to have trained on um, and improved um, Gyro, Brayshaw, Chera, Cox and Logue um, and Sean Darcy, those type of guys. And then, you know, Jesse Hogan and um, Lobb and um, Collier really got involved. So, um, yeah, there was a bit to light. Some of the things we're working on, um, trying to move the ball to our forwards a bit better. So, yeah, there was some pleasing results, but um, plenty of work to go. Um, they got a four day break now and we just said, you know, it's um, have a break, but, but stay focused on what you need to do because the season's coming around really quickly. You had the likes of Hogan, Lobb and Tavern working together in the same forward line for a lot of the game. What did you make of them? Yeah, we're going to go away and review. Yeah, it was a little bit windy, but I thought they, um, in particular, Hogan and Tavern were really involved and, and the pressure forwards, I think guys that have had big summers like Matir and Swatowski in particular, um, really impacted, so, so that was pleasing for us. Um, we had a number of senior guys over at the AFLX, you know, Wilson um, and Fife and uh, Brad Hill, and we've got a few out like uh, Stephen Hill and, and Conker who should return. So there was a bit of quality out and um, yeah, there were some good signs, you know, we're not getting carried away. It's first hit out, probably the most intense training session of the summer, so to speak. So. Um, there's some good signs of surging the ball, and um, you know, we. I read a club, another player from that club said we're not not about driving each other into the ground and you know injuring each other, but I thought we were still playing a pretty good competitive spirit. Good to see new drafty Lockie Schultz get involved in the first half, especially. Yeah, you got a bit of ball, yeah, particularly the first half. Yeah, so there's some reasonable signs there, and um, Sammy Sturt really off half back, he, his natural speed and kick was evident, so that was pleasing as well, and Bewley. Worked away also. And how about the midfield? How's that shaping up? You got Tom North who kind of put his hand up a little bit. Yeah, he did. He got a bit of ball. As I said, those young guys, another summer under their belt, they, they should, um, should improve. And, and that's what we're seeing. So um, it was a little bit scrambly in the second half, a little bit more. And at times it opened up. So, you know, a little bit of midfield talent out of there at the minute. Um, so with Fife and Hill. Blakely and the, and the other hills, so um, yeah, they're, they're, and Conker, so there's a, uh, um, and Wilson's not playing, so yeah, there, there's a bit to like there, but again, um, it, it's, you know, small steps. Gives you a lot to think about before picking the JLT team against Collingwood in about 10 days? Yeah, it's going to be difficult because um, everyone's, you know, quite vibrant and fresh, but it'd be the first disappointment. I think it's a squad of 26, so not everyone can play, but um you know, we'll, we'll work through that as, as it comes across our desk. And, um, you know, every session you want to work them as hard as you can without losing anyone. So player availability is the key, and, and that's improving. So that, that's a priority at the minute before we get the selection. Finally, did you have a message for the players after the game? Yeah, I did just what I spoke about. You know, we're pleased with the endeavour. Thank the Peel boys for coming up, Cam Shepherds, um, young players. That really, I think six guys come up. Um, you go to the break, but... Um, you know, we, we want you to enjoy yourselves, but it's important that the season's coming quickly and um, you, you need to apply yourself with what's put in front of you from our um, high performance manager. But, you know, have a good break and come back ready to go.